Hello everybody, welcome back to the series of unfortunate events. I like to call my life. This is the fifth and final episode and the time I flew home with laryngitis and a killer hangover. So every summer my family and I, we go to a little tiny village in Germany called Bracca. And to put into context of how small this village really is, you could probably bike around it in about 10 minutes. So my aunt and uncle decided before we left that they wanted to throw their 25th wedding anniversary in that little town. They invited all the villagers, everyone from the next town over and the next town after that, and it ended up being this larger than life party. We have bartenders, we have caterers, we have a semi truck filled with beer and schnapps, we're ready to go. But what was unfortunate for me was that I had my flight the next morning, but that didn't stop me. We partied until the break of dawn until one hour before I had to leave for my flight. So I had a little nap and I woke up in half an hour and got my stuff together and me and my mom left. Once we realized what time it was and how late we were, we left in a rush. And that's by the time that the hangover started to kick in. But this was not just your average hangover, ladies and gentlemen. This was something else. After taking two trains and one bus, I ended up throwing up all over myself, which kind of sucked because we were about to board a nine hour flight and I didn't have my luggage. So I see this little stand and I quickly buy a shirt and it ended up being a Russian communist shirt. So I had to get on the flight to Canada wearing a pretty much pro Putin shirt and that ended up being the worst nine hours of my life. What I didn't realize was when I got home, I actually had laryngitis as well. So it was kind of like this double whammy situation. I got an ear infection on the flight. I was extremely hungover. Everything was a mess. I had my shirt in a plastic bag filled with throw up and that's how the night went. Thank God I had my mom with me. It saved the day. I will never be doing that again. And if this is your sign to not drink before a flight, please do so. Thank you so much for listening. I'm Anna Hapler-Singer and this is Evolution 107.9.